Hey y'all, 2019's upon us. Time for, uh, first of all, the Holy Day, Mary Mother of God. Got my Mary Blue on, my Miraculous Medal. So, got that going for us. Plus we got our New Year's resolutions. And which is like, for me, I want to give a pop. That'll probably last till Tuesday. I want to exercise, do some planking, walking, a little bit every day. Don't want to do too much because I know I'll fail otherwise. I want to pray the rosary every day and I want to evangelize. I bought this camera a long time ago thinking, you know, God's calling me to evangelize and then I just don't do it. I, whether I'm not prepared, I think I got to be perfect, write the perfect script, blah, 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 whatever. I've always made excuses. It's a new year. Time to step it up. The laity, we've got to step it up, you know. Um, the clergy, they got their own problems. So, we have to step it up. We have to take it upon ourselves to share the gospel. Um, why? Why do we have to do that? First of all, it's necessary for us to grow in holiness. Actually, the Catechism of the Catholic Church says in paragraph 1816 that evangelization is necessary for salvation. So, there's that. We save our own souls. And plus, the world outside is dying. I mean, people are just selfish, they're greedy, they're lustful, they're angry, they're violent. And so, the cure to all that is a relationship with Jesus, okay? And people cannot have a relationship with Jesus if they don't know Him. Okay, the Bible says in Romans 10 that faith comes by hearing, okay? That means we have to share the story of salvation with them, all right? And so, it's on us, so... What I want to share with you right now is just a, a little five-step um, kerygma. The kerygma is a Greek word. It means the proclamation of the gospel. Gospel means good news, so a proclamation of the good news. That's the story of Jesus and the story of you and the story of salvation. There's five parts to it. Very basic. I'm not going to go long in this video. The first part is God loves you. He created you out of love to be in a relationship with Him forever, and He's got a plan for your life, all right? You're unique, you're precious, and you're unrepeatable, okay? That's what you need to know first. That was His original plan. The second part is sin entered the world. Adam and Eve fell. The devil influenced them. Um, and the result of their fall, their disobedience to God, is that they died spiritually. And we inherited that as their sons and daughters. We're all descended from Adam and Eve, and they were real historical people. Okay? Now with that, our, our nature is wounded, we're attracted to sin, our wills are weak, and our intellect is wounded or damaged. Um, but God loves us too much to leave us that way, so He sent His Son Jesus. He became man, He died on the cross to atone for our sins, and He rose from the dead for our salvation. Great, how do I make that mine? There's three parts. I got to put my faith in Jesus, repent of my sins, and get baptized. And then finally, Jesus established the Catholic Church to teach in His name, to empower us with His grace, and then to restore us to salvation if we fall. Okay, so we're not on our, on our own. We don't come up with our own doctrine by reading the Bible and then just deciphering it for ourselves. It doesn't work. I mean, there's thousands of Christian churches out there, and they all teach different stuff, contradictory stuff. So it obviously doesn't work. Jesus never commanded anybody to write anything down. He never wrote anything down himself. He told his apostles, He who hears you, hears me. So, you might say his apostles are gone. All we have is the Bible. Well, no, we have an unbroken line of apostles. They handed on their authority to men all the way back in the year 33, all the way down to today. And those, those bishops, we call them now, had the power handed on to them from the apostles. An unbroken line of succession. That's very important, very impressive. So, that's it. I'll talk to you later. I'll make another video um, soon. God bless.